Okay, so today I wanted to talk about a um, uh, recent occurrence. Uh oh, well, a very recent occurrence that just happened yesterday. I posted about it on Facebook. But uh, Nintendo appointed a new president finally after Iwata's passing. And it's Tatsumi Kimashima. Yeah, I don't think it was something that anyone was really expecting. I don't know. Literally, I don't think anyone expected it. I don't think anyone could have predicted it. Um, most of the, the two prime suspects seem to be um, Miyamoto and Takeda to be the the president because they were running they were running the show in uh, in the transition period between the new president. Um, but no, and I understand why Miyamoto wouldn't be the president only because he's he likes to be very involved in the creative parts. And he'd be able to have to be a lot more business oriented in that position, and it just doesn't seem to fit his personality or what he likes to do in the company. So I can understand that. Uh, but Satsumi, I didn't even—I don't think I've heard of him at all um, until now. And just looking at his history, he doesn't really have that much history—not near as much as something comparable to Iwata. So he's like—he's pretty much a wild card, but. He was, at one point he was representative director of the Pokemon company, and then, um, what should we call it? He was, he was, um, the CEO of Nintendo of America before Reggie was. Um, then he, he's been the managing director and in charge of human resources general manager, corporate analysis, all these random positions, really, that he's been doing right now, but nothing significant, nothing that would put him out in the spotlight, you know? And judging by, you can see the image here now, um, I don't know, maybe I'm judging a book by its cover, but he just doesn't seem the, the kind of personality that Iwata was, so I don't know. Hopefully we get to know him more as a person than we, than we see he's truly passionate like Iwata was. He had, Iwata had a certain special thing about him, how passionate he was, and he was able to be involved in Nintendo Directs. I really doubt this guy is going to be the face of the Directs, to be honest. Maybe someone like Sakurai or Miyamoto will will take the lead on that, but um, we'll see. We'll see. When is the next Nintendo Direct? I think there's supposed to be one pretty soon, actually, so it'll be interesting to see how they handle that. And also be really sad to see it without Iwata, but I just thought it's really interesting, because... Kimishima is really coming in at a really awkward time where the Wii U is still struggling. Um, 3DS is supposedly, judging by this article, nearing the end of its life cycle, which is a very good possibility, but you never know. Um, Nintendo's dive into mobile gaming, of course, was a big deal. Um, the new NX console, this quality of life initiative, was all, all like headed by Iwata, essentially. And now, uh, Kimishima, I got you get used to saying that name because I know I'm going to be saying it a lot. Now he's going to be heading all of these projects. He's going to be responsible for it all. It's a lot to take on all at once, I know. Um, so I really hope he has a nice vision. Um, I kind of wish they had gotten a more youth, like, more youthful president in there. I don't know. But of course I know nothing about him. That's, um... He just looks like a stereotypical businessman. But, of course, we just need to give him a chance, that's all. And it'll be interesting to see his first, like, public speaking event, how he addresses his, um, overtaking his goals and everything. I'd be interested to see something like that. So, guys, let me know what you think about this new president. Um, I don't think he'll, he'll ever live up to Iwata's legacy as a personality, as a character, and as a human being, but perhaps he could make a better, uh, a better position as, as president, who knows. Uh, we'll see how the company goes in the next few years, we'll, we'll tell that very well, you'll see the difference between his his reign as president and Iwata's reign, so long may he reign.